Sir, I was only following the lieutenant's orders. Cooperating with our allies isn't that the drill? Captain, you have converted our prison into a hotel for enemy nobles. I already told you. The lieutenant had to rescue the ladies to get Marcus to start talking. That's all this is, sir. The mission was a complete success. Ah, the lieutenant, no doubt returning from yet another daring and influential operation on my family's behalf and without our knowledge. Would you be so kind as to explain to me why there are three Thule nobles here insisting that they have a bargain with you? I made a deal with Marcus to get the information I needed. How dare you make arrangements with House Organa's prisoners without our permission? Indeed, without our very knowledge! I don't suppose you'd care to share the details of this illicit arrangement that you've conceived, Lieutenant? My deal was for the wife and daughter, not Marcus. But... but Marcus! My Marcus! No! No! Please, not father. Not father! Hush now, dears. I knew that this might come to pass, and it is a small price to pay for your safety. This... this agreement is satisfactory to House Organa, Lieutenant. The ladies will be remanded to the Republic's care as soon as arrangements are made. It has to be this way. You have my apologies. Yes, I understand. You. You're all monsters. Heartless beasts with no bravery or... or honor. We cannot change this, Valen. Nothing can. Oh, Marcus. My dearest Marcus. No. You'll pay for this. I won't rest until every single one of you is paid for this. No one's talking to you, little girl. No, but I'm talking to you. All of you. You'll pay. Someday you will. I swear it. I, uh, I'll leave you all to grieve, then. Farewell, Lieutenant. Captain. Guess you'll move on now, Lieutenant. You got your man. Palos is happy. Everything's tied up. I really appreciate your assistance, Captain. Been a pleasure to be a part of something so important, sir. A real pleasure. See you around, Lieutenant. <laughs>